Um, I am going to jump you in on this, Craig, because it's important to me to, to understand like where I stand with it. Mm -hmm. But I'm going to tell you one thing that I don't really, you know, stand 10 toes down on. What's that? And that's for exhibitionist situations going on uh. in public. I just really don't. I've, I've passed that phase in my life. And I think that I learn, and there's too many learning tools out there for people not to learn. Can we run it, Mo? Well, I'm well just put it there and I'll run it. Okay, okay one moment. <laughs> people who live next to an adult business say they're very grateful the city is trying to shut them down. Channel 2's Tom Jones, live now in Northeast Atlanta, where neighbors say they have to cover their children's eyes because of the indecent acts happening right near their homes. Now, so many people who live in this community were happy to talk about how they say customers from Tokyo Valentino disrupt their lives. By to hear at 5 o'clock, people who live... Oh, my God, why are they doing say, this? They're very grateful the city is trying to shut the... Kids are on the way to school. They're out there. I have to tell her to don't look at them. Neighbors say Tokyo Valentino's customers park in their community and they often see some walking around partially nude. Do you consider it a nuisance? Oh yeah, I really do. I don't think their clientele is very reputable. The city of Atlanta has sent Tokyo Valentino a non-compliance letter and a directive to cease and desist. The city says the business has illegal adult entertainment booths. It also says it captured a couple having sex in the parking lot. This is an adult establishment, which means that they have not stayed otherwise lawful. Tokyo Valentino appealed the city's decision to the city's Board of Zoning Adjustment. Its attorney says it doesn't operate as an illegal adult entertainment business. We contend that this effort violates due process, violates equal protection. Violates the First Amendment. Motion passed. The board Thanks. denied Tokyo Valentino's appeal. Neighbors say they hope it spells the end of their nightmare. I will be happy when they're shut down. I did not like you. Um, that was a steal, y'all. Yes. It was not the actual video playing. Because. That was a steal. Yes, because it belongs to. The that was a steal. Network. You know, so we just put the steel picture, but I played the video in the background. Um, here she go, y'all. Wait, Mo. It's a little. Is we over? Are we? Are you in? Mm -hmm. Here she go, y'all. Take it out, Mo, please. Aye, aye. More, more. That's what he said. He didn't. But it's enough. Girl, I had to wear my white today because we got some things to talk about. Mm -hmm. are, we, are you in enough? Am I in enough? Mm -hmm. I can always go in a little further. Carlton, but, but uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I, be, I beg your pardon. Carlton, <laughs> are you there? <laughs> ah! Oh, Ho happy Sunday, everybody! Mm. I had to wear my white today because you know we're gonna get into some things. Girl, we having some salads right now, honey. Cause I, we, love a, I love a salad. Cause we getting tossed tonight. I love a salad. We getting tossed tonight, girl, like a dog. Mm. I ain't tossed no salad in a moment. Mm. Mm. But y'all mm. had wore my white because you know we're gonna be talking about church lady Latasha Scott. Yes, I heard yeah. this girl. I, I looked over there what you sent Mo earlier. I was yeah, like, girl, what is scared. she? What is she doing, honey? That's why if you one thing you have to, to catch our titles when I put. Who can identify? Right. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Who's there? No, that oh. was somebody. <laughs> oh. Mm. They say my mic is low. They keep saying it. Am I not in it? What? They keep saying like five people oh. have said it. Hello, hello. Wait, hold on, hold on. Make me, make me feel. Mm. Is my mic low? Girl, no. Oh. Hold on. Is it better? Work in the microphone. Because mm -mm, it's not even. What about now? Is it better now? Let's Talk. Mic on. Yeah, because it's not even. It, hold on. Let me see something real quick. Is it better? They say no. No. Yeah, no, no, it's not. Because I'm um, looking at the level. It's not even. Oh, it is low? It's not on. Oh. It's to pull it out and we'll put it back in. My God. Mm. Hello? Hello? Can you guys hear me now? 
Do you think we need a new mic cord? Do we have another an extra mic cord in there? Oh, his mic is not on at all. Oh, so the motherfucker in there. Let me lean into your one. <laughs> he'll create while I handle this. Right. So the motherfucker in there who said my microphone was fine, you said you just didn't want to hear me. Oh, okay, let me <laughs> let, let me go back in here and block you. <laughs> so that's what you were trying to say. <laughs> he said it was fine. <laughs> make me, make me, make me, make me feel. What? Can y'all hear me on this one? Oh, you're switching it out. Well, you don't want to find the camera. You got on draw today. I always have on draw. Really? Yeah. I'm just wondering why he didn't check all of this when he was. He didn't know. He mm. wouldn't know. Because we don't mess with it. Oh, we don't uh, is this is this why they say I don't like you? Is this why? <laughs> is this why they say I don't like you? I guess so. Mo, you can never be red. We don't know hieroglyphics. I, I don't know why y'all be saying that about Mo, me and Mo. Curly really red. It's Egyptian. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. All right, talk for it. Make me, make me, make me, make me feel. Make me, make me, make me, make me, make me feel. Can y'all, can y'all hear me? Because his levels are not on at all. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, they saying no. Yeah. <clears throat> Girl, what didn't happen? What y'all been doing in here? What, what were y'all doing while I was gone? We didn't do nothing. Well, why the microphone ain't working? Who been, who been sitting over here? Murder, it's Mercury retrograde, girl. <laughs> can y'all hear me now? Y'all can hear me? Murder, just put the old one. They said it's a dead mic. Make me, make me, make me, make me feel. Yeah, I want to talk about this Latasha Scott. Oh, you don't want me to jump into that yet? Oh, from the uh, the thing, the Facebook thing. So, right. So I do think that what you're feeling is probably a little bit of conflict because you see the benefit of it, mm -hmm. of having this private Facebook group for the girls. Mm -hmm. But you also recognize how messy it can become. And I think it's because right now as it stands, it's women and gay boys who are basically outing the trade. Right. Where, hello, can you guys hear me? Make me, make me, make me, make me feel. Mr. Pork. Can y'all hear? Let me know if y'all can hear Can you hear me now? You guys can hear me now. Yeah, hear it now. It's the port. Yeah, because I just switched my mic. I just switched mine with his. And, and so it's the port. So it's the whole tr control panel? No, it's just. Oh, just that. This, this port, one port. That one port. So I, I need to mess with it and find that one mm -hmm. port. Okay. Make me, make me, make me, make me feel. So I think what you're saying is it's conflicted. You feel conflicted because it's women in there and gay boys just outing the people. Where what you're saying is the benefit of it would be for trans women to be able to say, to be able to use a group and to be able to post a picture and write about their experience a negative experience where either the guy didn't pay them or he abused them some kind of way. And it was a way to kind of protect people down the line from experiencing that same thing. But again, if it's a private group on like a Facebook, then you could set it up where it's when people post, you see the post first. You have to preview it before it's actually put into the group. Um, but then it's unfair just to say if it's unfair to women, because I'd like to know if a group of my husband is cheating on me. Well, that's a whole nother group. That's a different conversation. It's the same conversation, though. No. That, it's nuanced. Because, see, this, this group is for the trainees. <laughs> <laughs> the trainees. Okay. You know, to protect you all. You know, like if you're working girls. Mm -hmm. So that if somebody has stiffed them, kind of like Bobby Valentino did. Mm-hmm didn't pay that lady her money. Mm -hmm. And instead of her exposing her on social media, yeah, she could have done that, but then she could have also used this group 
to put his picture in there and say, you know, R and B singer, slow down. I just wanna get to know ya. Don't turn around. There's a pretty little thing that I am. Hey. Yeah. Okay, well, Craig, let's let me ask this question. Uh huh. Let me shake the table with this question. Shake it. Ready? Yeah. Don't women have the right to know? Well, see, that's a separate group. But this is too many groups around uh, based around the same thing. Not really. It's kind of like th the other group is a group for heterosexual women who may want to know if their man is into uh, trans women. And so this would be a group for them. That's separate from the group for the trans girls for, for protection me mechanisms. But, but I don't think you need to confuse the two. That's, I, I am confused. That's too much. Well, 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 let me help you. You know, there's a separate group. Kiki. Kiki wrote this about five times. It ain't no group yet. Well, there is no group yet. This is hypothetics. Now, the no, there that, is a group. Now, the group that you're talking... No, I'm talking, the one I'm talking about is not existing. Yeah, the group that I'm talking about, there's a group of them posting, the, 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 the saying the DL trades. They asking if you... You're going to name, name the group? Mm -mm. Just go over there and search it. I'm not naming the group. On Facebook. But I saw it, and I said, oh, shit. Uh-huh. And it was tons and tons and tons of pictures in there. Like tons of boys, of trades. Mm-mm. Well, see, that's a separate group. That's a different kind of group. That's a different kind of group. I went to a birthday party last night. Because here's the thing, Craig. I don't care if you trade or not. I just want to know if you're going to try to take my purse. Well, that's the group. But it doesn't matter to me because I'm not a, I'm not a bio one. I'm not a, a bio straight identified woman either. You, you, you see what I'm saying with the layers? Right, but I don't think bio women care about that because they're not necessarily getting robbed by the trade. Yes, they are. When trade rob, they rob everybody. Your person ain't got nothing to do with your gender identity. I don't know them. This, this is where I'm at. I don't know. I still think it's two different groups. But it's not, though. It is, because if because I was. Because some of the trades. Uh -oh. Ooh. Go ahead. Some of the trades are married. Right, but if I was a straight woman, I wouldn't give a damn about what's going on in the group with the trans girls. I wouldn't care about the if, if somebody robbed you, if they didn't pay you. I just want to know if my boyfriend or my husband is out here with the trans girls. Cheating. But the gag is they can occupy both groups. They can. But then they need to join both groups. But this is what I'm saying. Then it becomes like this outing of girl. That's why I said it's, it's, it's two different groups. See, in the other group, with the women, they're going to just post their husband. Have you all seen him? Okay. Do you know him? Hmm. So let's say the woman posting the group, <clears throat> have you seen him? And then you show up and I show up. Girl, he love me. You and me both show up. How's the group separate? Because the group with the trans girls is very specific. That's for y'all community. I don't get it. How is it for y'all? You mean for, okay, you mean this is for our safety? Yes, that's a safety group. Okay.
Now, can we move on to Latasha Scott? Because I'm ready. We're coming to Latasha, girl. I'm ready to get to her. Girl, I need some clearance on this, Craig. You need to help me get some clearance. Girl, I don't know what else to say about that. No, I didn't gave you what. I didn't gave you what. What I think. Oh, come on, fit for a queen sick. I think Craig is missing the point. Go on. Wait. The group is about protecting women as a whole, trans or bio. Right, but. We, I'm not missing the point. What I'm saying is the trans group, when we started talking about it, was about protecting trans women from being abused by someone who already has a history of doing that or somebody who already has a history of stiffing people for their money. The other group is about women gaining clarity if their man is cheating, whether he's cheating with a trans girl or not. Girl, that, that story can go into the group about cheating, period. I don't think there necessarily has to be a trans group for that. It just needs to be a group about cheating, which there it already exists. Are you dating my man? I think it's what it's called. And if you are a trans person and you're dating somebody's man, put that all in that same group. Why it got to be a separate group? Why y'all always got to have something special for y'all? <laughs> You give me one second. Don't you move, Mo. What? Why y'all got to have something separate for y'all self? Don't you move. Because <laughs> the bitch shaking the table now. <laughs> right. right. Well, girl, you trainees or something. Y'all always got to have something separate for yourself. Give me, one, give me two bites. <laughs> Trans people, I'm just joking. Don't you email me. Yes, they are. Don't you email me. Don't you email me. Well, y'all always got to have something separate for yourselves. Man, you said two bites. And I don't know. Y'all can't be with the rest of the women. Y'all can't be with the rest of the women. Or the fags. Well, please give me a nap. Why y'all can't go in the group? I see what she's doing here. Here. Why y'all can't be in the group with, the, with everybody else? Hmm. Thank you, Linda Love, for my cash app. Thank you. Do it again. <laughs> Do it again. Why, why y'all got to have y'all own separate Facebook group? Well, we didn't make it that way. Well, who made it that way? Well, because the people don't think that men that like women like us too. Wait, what? People don't think that men that like bio women like trans women too, especially when they're liking us on the when they look at women on the entire on the spectrum of women. Correct. And so, because they don't think this, they think that it needs to be a separate group. When in all actuality, when it boils, when men boil it down, when the men that fuck the cunts and fuck the wolves. <laughs> but I'm just saying it feels like. But they don't have, but Craig, we didn't make it that way. Right, but what I'm saying is the purpose of these groups in my eyes are different. Mo, come on, I need the comments. The group that we were talking about, we were talking about initially was about protection for trans girls. But it all falls under the same pretense, though. I know, but... And so, when we talk about this, we say this in the space of when the men say, I like variety of women on a whole, mm -hmm. the cunts have already excused, have already excused the world's from the conversation because mm -hmm. he's only he's only talking about heavy, skinny, dark, light, uh -huh. Korean, Spanish, uh, uh, African. He's only talking about this type. When it comes down to the girls, they not talk. No, nah, he can't be talking about y'all because y'all is niggas. Uh huh. Is what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. So I'm glad that you did that. Uh mm huh. -hmm. I'm glad that you shook the table because you, bitch, you shook the table with that right there. Because that's one of the things. Uh -huh. That's why it, 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 they, they put it to the space of having a group of, because they have, they have separated. Kind of like when I, was, when, when I was over there advocating for uh, certain situations and, the, and that woman got on there. Remember, remember we was dissecting her video mo, and she was calling us the... Uh, the sister women. Oh yeah, 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 I do remember 
She removed me completely from the women. Yeah, girl, child. Yeah. She removed me completely from being black. Mm -hmm. And say black women, we don't need the help from none of them over there because we don't need them. Mm. We don't need none of the sisters from them. Let them have their own thing. So again, we're back to the space of the of the removing of the Baphomet. <laughs> but see, I think if you have this one group, if you consolidate these groups and you have bio women and trans women in this group, then you're going to have conflict between the bio women who don't fuck with trans women. Correct. That all of that. But but here, llama. Craig. But at the end of the day, the lowest the, the lowest common denominator that uh, that's that's factored into this whole situation is the man correct that's that is the whole centerpiece the nucleus the nucleus is that that's what it is right there on the spot Mo, we letting the comments pile up i know you tell that setup because it's good yeah <laughs> but that's what that's that's why we can't come to no space of understanding you know what what everything is because we're still we got this group over here and this group over here when the main group that's in the in both groups in both sections is the nigga right but i i just think that i think my point more so is it's i'm not saying that men don't rob and sexually assault women because they clearly, do clearly they do they do but it seems like a real theme in your community and like what you said earlier was a lot of times they'll kill trans women in order to keep their secret right so that's why i'm saying i feel like it's slightly nuanced i feel like the group needs to be separate you know for that reason because i just feel like that's a whole different conversation a whole different platform like it really is about you know, I had an experience with this guy. He said he was going to pay me this amount of money. We got to the hotel. He stiffed me. He left me or he drugged me or he did this. Like, that's information that trans women who engage in sex work, and even the ones who don't engage in sex work, because it's not always about sex work with trans women. I think sometimes... I think sometimes men approach trans women in ways that are just about sex and not about the, about the courting or dating or trying to get is, to and, know you and then there are men that approach approach trans women the exact same way that they approach bio women they just approaching a woman correct you get what i'm saying and then you know it's whether we take the route of it's going to be it's going to be sexual sexually right. driven as, 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 as sexual objects cam said yeah but that's but here's the thing that's been a that that is a stigma in our community that is that that mm -hmm. i can't say happens but then there are men that approach me on the street there are men that approach me on the thing that have not that that we that are trying to communicate and get to know mm -hmm. you know it's all it all depends on where i want to go with it if i want to take it sexual right so for example like let's just say bio women set up a facebook group because mm -hmm. they're like me too um, you know, because they're like survivors of some sort of a sexual assault and they partner it up with Me Too. Now, granted, we could say that trans women could fall under that, but I think that that's separate. I think that that would be a group for bio women to do because they've had some sort of sexual something in the workplace or da 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 Doesn't mean that it doesn't happen to trans women, but I just, I don't know. I just feel like it would create some sort of a contention in that group because you would have bio women saying, well, what is she doing here? Trans women are not real women. You understand what I'm saying? I feel like that group would be slightly nuanced. And I feel like this group that you're talking about is slightly nuanced. But with a Me Too, why would it be? I know that there's overlap, but what I'm saying is I think there's enough, you know, distinction where I think the two could be separated there's no difference i don't know how else to say it okay well those are your thoughts and i'm not and i'm not you know mm -hmm. here's the thing and this is this is this is where you people should learn something here he has his thoughts i have mine i don't agree with his thoughts mm -hmm. but i'm not over here bitch you mother i'm not doing that mm -hmm. i'm just we're both pointing it out 
p pointing out areas in the conversation mm -hmm. to where we can, you know, put our thoughts on the line and then be like, oh, I didn't see it that way. Uh -huh. Or, oh, I might see it that way. Oh, okay, well, I don't agree with that, mm -hmm. but I feel, you know, that this is the way this should be, you mm -hmm. know. Anyway, so you guys can battle about that all in the comment section. That was just my experience of me talking about it. That's how I wanted to open up the um, the show. But I didn't want to go right into Tasha Scott. We ain't got to go into that because we had something from last week that we didn't talk about. Let's talk about these white people down in Mexico. You wanted to talk about the white people or did you want to talk about the other? Did you want to talk about Tajik Hall since we're talking about Oh, yeah, people? let's get. Girl, we talking about white people. We can talk about Tajik Hall. 